remember what the haters talking about. What's up, family? A Drexel University professor was arrested and reportedly charged with two felonies for redirecting over $189,000 in research grants from the university into his own account and spending the money on luxuries such as strippers, sports bars, iTunes, and more. 57-year-old Chikar Danaka Wangpa the former head of Drexel's computer engineering department was charged with theft by unlawful taking and theft by deception for his actions. His arrest comes more than three months after Drexel reportedly repaid the U.S. government for improper use of the research grants after being made aware of his frivolous spending. The money was originally meant for energy and naval research, but between the years of 2007 and 2017, Wong Pa repurposed the funds and made it rain in the strip clubs and sports bars. Wong Pa was getting his groove on. He spent the money also on iTunes purchases and what they labeled as goods and services. Everything was all gravy until the university did an internal audit. Cole busted him. Now, even though the university paid the government back, Wong Pa was not originally charged. He gave the university approximately $53,000 back and resigned from his position from the university. Wong Pa thought it was all over, but then the feds came knocking. Do, 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 do. Boom, 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 boom. That's how them feds be knocking. Boom, boom. Just like on TV. Boom, boom. <laughs> well, actually, typically the fan, fans don't knock. Typically, the fans the fans are smooth, man. They walk right up on you. Mm -hmm. Have an arrest. I want to be arrested. Arrest. Come with us. <laughs> fans are real smooth because they have your routines uh, down so packed. By the time they come and get you, they know everything, every move you're about to make. So when they get you, it's typically real smooth. You're like a deer in headlights. You're like, gone. And, and it's hard to beat them because they do, unlike the police, they actually investigate for weeks, months, and years. But I don't think any of us are surprised by this. But $189,000, that's a whole lot less than some of you guys be giving your pastors. It's a whole lot less than Trump and his family is spending. I think, what do they spend, like a half a million dollars a day, a million dollars a day or something of the taxpayers' money? It's a straight ripoff. The dude has spent tens of millions of dollars in golfing alone. Golfing! Your tax money paying for this blob of fat meat grease to play golf. This uh, is, is fairly tame compared to what these corporate beasts be out there doing. These people out here in corporate America, the stuff that they do, if you found out what they're actually doing, how they're siphoning money from the American people, oh. Whew. some of y'all would just give up hope on humanity. Some of y'all, some of you don't want to know the truth because you can't handle the truth. It'll just make you just say, you know what, man, from now on, I ain't working no more. I'm finna do things my way. I'm finna do things the way that they do it. And they are really, really dirty. But what do y'all think is going to happen now? What kind of time do you think you're gonna get? Let's take a bet. I'm taking all bets. I say they're gonna give him about, let's see, he paid $53,000 back of the 189. 
that shows an effort that he was trying to do right after he got caught up. So he was trying to pay the money back. So he owes another, what? what is that, another 130000 or so is what he owes. It was about what? What is that? About 133, 136, about 136. So he still owed like $136,000. Will he pay all the money back? Perhaps not. I think what's going to happen is that he'll probably get like a three year sentence, a three year federal sentence, somewhere in that neighborhood. Uh, I know that you may think it's a lot of money, but. That one, $136,000, that's not a lot of money. When you consider, like I said, what these corporate thieves be out here doing and what Donald Trump is doing, uh, that's not a lot of money at all. So I think he'll get somewhere between a maybe a 18-month to three-year sentence. That's what I think that he, they'll give him. But what say you? What, what type of time you think he's looking at? Drop a comment. No more talk. What the haters talking about? Yeah.